Hello everyone, and this is the Carry On, and welcome back to another episode of East Nordics. Um, just a quick heads up, I did make some minor changes to my settings and my streaming software, as well as uh, in here. Um, the only thing I did here was actually change the frame rate limit to 60 to potentially help with the stream, make it as smooth as possible and less laggy. Um, hopefully everything is now working pretty good. So let's go ahead and continue our adventure. Shall we? I think we were, uh, I thought we were on the boat. Guess not. That's right, we ended up uh, landing on this island. Here we go. This should be a good spot to rest. See if there's anything over here. But I don't want that. Cheer resolution. I'll have to get some sake soon. Uh, yeah, it might be your VPN, but then again, it could also be Twitch, knowing Twitch. Twitch has been awfully buggy lately, like, it shows on my screen, on my Twitch screen right now, that I'm live, but I'm looking at the video, and the video says it's offline, though I haven't refreshed the chat, uh, page since starting the stream, but I can clearly see your messages. As they're coming through, plus this shows me the selection time, the viewers, and the bit rate looks like crap, but, I mean. It might just be Twitch, then. Don't know what's going on. Uh, actually, while I'm sitting here, kill the massage. I love my massage pad. And let's go ahead and check something that's been bugging me. Uh, let's see. It could also be my internet, because I just checked that notification I've been seeing, and it's saying, uh, it's dropping frames, and it could, it's due to poor internet connection, so, could very well just be my internet being shitty. I gotta contact them on it again. Oh, well.
Yeah, I'd probably say it's due to my internet being unstable. Though I could always try changing the bitrate around, see if that'll help. Let's go ahead and do that. It shouldn't really affect things. Uh, no, it won't actually let me do it. Not while I'm streaming. <sighs> How's the visuals look aside from the legginess? I thought you wouldn't ask. Um, let's see. I forget where to go. Let's change up his hair. That wasn't the blue. That wasn't the blue either. There we go. Definitely not. High probability, because I love the little wings on the back. Well, the feathers. Honestly, I don't know how I feel about that one. 
the one leg showing and then the other one just full pant leg. I, I don't like that at all. I mean, it's a style, but... Ugh. Uh... Let's go with the Raven. For now. A rare find. Can I break you? No. <laughs> Thought you could hide from me. Oops, that uh, was not the move I was working on, was it? No, it was. I thought we completed that. For a second, I could have sworn I just saw blood on the wall and then it just vanished. are supposed to drop in one hit. You know, I, I feel like they're lacking in the details in these Grieger. Like, they could have added so much more detail to them. But, it's meh. Uh, I don't have red hair anymore. It's black, bitch.
Who the fuck's listening, bitch? It's just the three of you. On the bright side, I did do one other change to my settings, and that is actually, the moment I start streaming, it's also recording, so I got a backup of the entire stream on my desktop, so if... There's any problem with the Twitch stream? I can just upload the backup onto YouTube. So, yay! Hopefully, it turns out better than the stream. I don't know until I actually see the footage for myself. That, this situation reminds me of that song, you know, Why Can't We Be Friends? At, at least he speaks his mind. He's not wrong either. I actually like that charge attack. Looks like it's got a good area of effect. I mean, not really worth. So, the only enemies I've even seen in this game so far, aside from the worm, was the Grieger.
Uh, no. She ain't really got anything I want. Uh, 64 of those? Sure, why not? Always a pleasure. See you again next Uh this way? This way. It should be a good spot to rest. Shut up, Law. I mean a doll. I bet we can catch something here. Didn't we are you? I mean they're back. Uh, well, that too. Oh my god, I'm not used to hitting select to do the whole fishing shit. Oh, no, no, no. Cancel, cancel. I wanted to use this bait. Show me what you got, brother. Go fight. Holding a big one. Isn't that my first time catching this? <laughs> it's an S right off the bat. I'll take it. So I really don't think the recording is actually affecting the stream at all. Side quest here. I think I know what this is now. I was thinking about it the other day. And I was like, wait, isn't that the whole um, treasure thing that they were talking about? North. Not the button I wanted. Oh, that's probably the star. Some speed, real quick. And we're off this way. Yep. Kind of looks like the area we saw on that map. Just about does it. 
Alright, that one's done. Let's head up here. Go knock that out real quick. Actually, we can just warp. Sure, if you don't mind dying. I'm left with no choice. How about you? I don't actually get to fight him? Fuck. Apologies for the late introduction. My name is Cuthbert. I'm a priest of the Hieroglyph Church. Adel and Karja, was it? Watching you fill those monsters stirred me to my very soul. Might I ask for the particulars of how you did so? If it isn't any trouble, of course. What a preferred speed. Maybe even the handling a little. Mana cell, recharge, definite, as well as the acceleration. Do you mean I can finally explore the island? It probably isn't much. Oh, 
Looks like I was already over. Oh, I was. I forgot I was already here. And with that wrapped up, I think it's safe to say I can go here now. Let's track. Yeah, I would say so. Because the only other thing is here and I can't get through yet. Well, since I'm already this far, oh my god, can get out of my fucking cabin. Tinkering with ships is f anything else? You know what? Didn't think so. Might as well, since we're here. There we go. God damn, <laughs> I keep fucking that up every single time. Okay. Let's eh, let's go face. ahead and fight. Alright, the fight is on. Enemy ship down. Whoa. Looks like everyone's okay. Bet I could put this ship to good use. Speed it up! Honestly, I wish the sailing was just a tad bit faster, you know? Fish something up. That's gotta be Dolphin Rock. And that huge wall of fog over there must be the white shade the fishermen mentioned. Definitely seems like the kind of place we should avoid until we're fully prepared. No. Agreed. For now, let's keep our distance and scout the area just outside the fog. No, fuck that. Let's go in. Keep track of the fog's position relative to the ship as you go. Miss Kaja! What's wrong? Report. It's the wind! The wind is changing direction! The white shade is coming. This isn't good. Adel, get us out of here. The heck is all this? I can't even see past the railing. This might be the worst fog I've ever experienced. It seems to be especially thick above us. The sun's light is almost completely blocked out. Yeah, they weren't kidding when they called it the White Shade. Zero visibility ahead! Princess, the compass's needle won't stop spinning! Oh, man. I'm starting to think this isn't just some low-lying cloud. Harsh bones. I did hear before that Normans in the old days had a way of finding the sun's position no matter how overcast it was. Don't think that's gonna help us in this situation. Adel. Think we can reverse course and go back up the way we came? Question is, is 
Which direction? Couldn't turn back even if we wanted to. I can hardly tell Bao from Stern anymore. You really can't see a thing, can you? It's all so weirdly quiet. As if all sound is being absorbed into the fog. Uh, are we sure it's a good idea to keep going? Well, we'll just need to pay close attention and use our best judgment. Huh? What's that? Hey! I see something out on the horizon! Trees? No way! Adol! We need to lower our speed immediately! I see something through the fog! There's an island! Dead ahead! That can't be right! Yeah, there shouldn't be an island of this size anywhere near this area. Which means either we drifted off course without realizing, or... At any rate, it's too dangerous for us to risk these waters without knowing which way is up. Adol, land us at that island for now. It doesn't seem like the White Shade's planning to lift anytime soon, does it? All the more reason for us to get out of here as soon as we can. It wouldn't be safe to venture out into the fog without some sort of plan, though. From the looks of things, the fog isn't so bad over on dry land. Oh, yeah, you're right. Good idea. We'll leave it up to you, as usual. Aye. If we can at least get our bearings and find out which island this is, then we can figure out how to escape. While you're at it, I guess the rest of us will try to gather up some food and water. In that case, why don't I come with you? This island gives me a serious case of the willies, so I'd rather we play things safe. Celia. Understood. Appreciate the help. As for me, I think it'd be best if I stayed back and gave the ship a quick inspection. All right, then. If we all know what we're doing, then let's get to it. You three be careful out there. Got it, Adel? No, never. We can catch something here. Okay, let's give it a shot. Go fight! Looking good. Here, let me help. Let's do this. Looking good. One. All right, let's give that one a shot. Go 
At least that's a good guide to know what bait to use. This is And as per normal, the music's actually really good. Hard to see on land, huh? Mind where you step, princess. Don't gotta tell me twice. Watch our backs, Belia. Roger that. Let's catch our breath. Run away! Something's there. Burn a blaze! Run away! I seriously love that. The surfboard is freaking awesome. Ah, poison. Damn it. Meant to go through. Sit still for a moment. And it's not actually healing. Probably due to the poison. Now it should go on. Now? I did it! 
Use it while I still got it. Okay, I think I got them all. You look like an enemy. Karja, how many times do I gotta tell you? I'm the one in charge. I see chess. It's actually a downgrade. Valuable. 
Maybe one upgraded? We'll have to check that out. How about now? Nope. Close. I must have to go this way first. Which means we're going back here. Yay! We're going to see an old man. My health's been much better recently, so I keep expecting that my memories will come back too, but... Oh, alas. At any rate, it seems like the map would be best left with you, Adol. I feel bad for these ones. <laughs> That's straight up hole kill. Monocence might come in handy here. Monocence might come in handy here. Yeah, that was actually Monocence obvious. Why would I need Monocence to tell me that? Now, this is a more useful method for it. Okay, that's useful.
Oh, you have to use it. Didn't expect this here. Well, I guess that makes it more useful. Okay, dumbass. Uh Well, it don't matter. That's useful. Getting ever so closer. Let's make tracks. I should have been able to make that. There we go. Okay, let's give it a shot. I don't think it's anything special. Yeah. Is... I noticed after I cast that there was nothing there. Something's there. I mean, I just wanted to play with you. Didn't expect this here. Might as well save.
Yeah, it's that simple. Well, I guess I gotta go down. Alright, I can move from that one. Okay, that would be dope. I think that's the only other one I don't see. Uh, it looks like that'll be the first one we go with because it's got the highest SP cost. Then we'll do probably one of these two. Probably this one because we already started. Alright, time to keep spamming B. Oh, no distance. How did I miss that? Let's make tracks. So picky. Well, I got up here, but I don't see a way forward there. And no way there. Not like I have to. But I kind of want to. That is so fun. 
Sense might come in handy here. Why? For that little piece of loot right there. Didn't expect this here. Eh, that's actually useful. See you've returned. Have you discovered <laughs> something of interest? A key. Now, what could that have been for? I get the feeling we've had this conversation before. Not that long. That's in the Forbidden Lands, the only place on the whole island that absolutely no one is allowed to enter. Of course, I say that, but I'm the only person who lives here anyway. Come to think of it, how did I even know about that? Oh, that's right. I was just about to go for a walk. See now, old man. Feel free to look around here a bit in the meantime. Do let me know if you figure anything out. Oh, don't worry, I will. <laughs> I'm probably gonna be taking a short break here soon. say that might be Karja's mom. Could be wrong. Could be wrong. might come in handy here. Mana! Or what? Oh. Yeah! Didn't expect this here. Where are you running? Yeah, 
Anything else? <laughs> Turns out that spot had a hidden mechanism. Hey, way to go, princess. You too, Adol. Never knew mana could be used like that. I'm not used to that short range. Quick, I'll give it that. Looks valuable. And maybe one that's leveled up. <laughs> Can't go down. Okay. This should be a good spot to rest. Save and I'll be right back. I gotta go to the bathroom.
All right, there we go. Correction, there we go. I just want to try to collect everything I can. This way, I think. What a pain in the hind. It's like a maze of thick fog. Let's make sure to remember the way we came. Mona! Sense might come in handy here. Found something. I can't you handle one monster? Why do I get the feeling I'm going in the right direction?
Is that like, uh... Yeah, unfortunately. I guess I could take that one off and put... This there? Track of where we are just now. Same here. We should be pretty far in though. Nothing else to do but press onward. Let's tackle it together. Seems interesting. something I don't want but this force upon us. Monosense might come in handy here. Let's catch our breath. I bet we can catch something here. Okay, let's give it a shot. That's all we need. Go ahead and save. That's progress. Hold it. I see something. Huh? It looks like a building. Too detailed for that. <sighs> I bet you do, Lucian. I bet you do. Though so I do have to agree that is an awesome outfit on her. I mean, yeah, it shows off a lot of skin, but 
Honestly, I don't even care about that feature. Though so the tails kind of end up killing it. Speaking of, let's go ahead and remove the tail. I want to jump on the buildings. You like Karnak from just about every angle. How is that possible? Well, let's just check around for now. Uh, huh? Uh, oh, yeah. Something about this place is really putting me on edge. This is the end you were staying at, right? Let's check it out. <sighs> What's going on here? It's not the inn inside. This looks more like Gran and the others hide up. Come in, me. A puppet breaker. Don't let your guard down, shield brother. Actually, have a fight on our hands. Not really a fight. It's now or never. Princess, Anno, do it! <laughs> I know it. about all this saddle reckon she might have had something to do with all the strange stuff going on here so you think so too huh for the time being let's get her back to the sandras philia you might escort rosa back to the ship huh <sighs> why why are you what is my sister doing here it's been a long time rosalind It's just like it sounds. Philia was from Karnak to begin with. But she's been part of the Baltic Sea Force ever since she married a Norman. Rosa! <laughs> it really is you, Rosa! Rosa, I'm so glad you're okay. Everyone! Hey, what's the matter? This is supposed to be a happy reunion, so where's the energy? <sighs> she wasted it all from crying. Especially right after you saved me. Let me try to explain the situation. <sighs> My sister, Philia, was a free spirit, but she was also well loved. The pride and joy of the Rosemary Inn, and I was always proud to call her family. But at some point, she grew smitten with a Norman man who stopped by the town, and one day, without saying a word to anyone, she suddenly vanished from Karnak altogether. Then, about a year or so later, we learned that she'd gone off to Balta Island to marry the man. From there, rumors started floating around Karnak. People would say that the Rosemary Inn was secretly working with the Balta Sea Force. Suddenly, our once thriving business could barely get anyone through its doors. We were on the verge of having to shut the whole place down. But despite that, my mom and dad worked themselves to the bone, trying to turn people's opinions around. It was only after years of backbreaking effort that they were finally able to win back some customers. And yet, during all that time... <sighs> oh, 
Wait, then Felia's... You're saying she's that Felia? Now that you mention it, she looks so different from how she used to, it didn't even occur to me. But I guess you'd figured it out, huh, Mira? Well, we were friends after all. I'm sorry. I don't mean to dump all of this on you, Adol, especially after everything you've done for me. <sighs> Princess? Draw your sword, Felia. What? We're going to fight. No holding back, either. Whoa. What are you doing? <laughs> Good thinking, shield brother. Rosa, we're supposed to be friends, right? Then I'm gonna act like one and stick my nose in whether you like it or not. Huh? Seriously, what's going on? Why the hell are they having a duel? Isn't it obvious, you dumbass? I'm not sure, but I got the sense Karja knows what she's doing. <laughs> Clearly. Wait, now that I think about it, was it Felia... Here I come! A lethal strike, Princess. You're serious? Honestly, I don't mind watching this cat fight. What? It's uh, participating in it. Whoa. Amazing. But she's never been in a fight before. Back in the day, no. She was always a frail girl. For real? She's actually holding her own against Karja? I thought she was the Sea Force's strategist or something, but turns out she's a first class warrior. No shit, Sherlock. <laughs> You sure? Karcha. Ilya's husband is from one of the most famous warrior families on Balls Island. So, in order for them to wed, she had to meet a certain condition at first, becoming shield brethren with him in under a year. Princess, please! Quiet, Ilya. If you won't explain it to her, I will. Shield brethren? Like what Adol did? That's right. Now, can you imagine how tough that must have been for your frail sister to pull off? It might have only been a year, but the training she went through was grueling, enough to make even us Normans balk. <sighs> the way Grimson tells it, that's just how strong-willed she was, not just in terms of her feelings toward her husband, but toward you and your parents, too. <gasps> Princess, the Rusvarian, your family, who are no friends of the Vault Seaforce, were targeted by a band of other pirates looking to take over Karnak. What? The pirates had opened a bar in town to bring in some income. Your family's tavern was doing so well that it was cutting into their business. So they planned to get rid of you by attacking the inn and slaughtering everyone inside. S slaughtering I think I remember hearing about this. The pirates were wanted to pretend to be the Vault of Seaforce so they could pin the blame on them, but they never actually went through with it. Right. Because they couldn't. The Vault of Seaforce worked with the people of Karnak to stop them. And the one who convinced the Seaforce to intervene? Ophelia, shortly after she joined our ranks. She mediated between the Sea Force and the mayor. And then she and her husband took the pirates out before they could act. So that's what happened. Her husband cut down the enemy leader himself, but he came out so injured that now he's unable to wield a sword the rest of his life. <gasps> they did all that for the inn? It should go without saying. I truly do love my husband, but I wanted to save the inn too. I was beside myself about it, really. Ultimately, though, trying to have it both ways just hurt everyone I cared for. I. I. <laughs> Rosa! That's me. Come on, Cruz, let's go after her! What? No! There are Krieger all over the place, remember? Adol, I'm begging you, please come with us! Don't gotta tell me! Let's go ahead and do another quick save. Hey! Rosa! She can't have gotten too far. Sheesh, they put us out. <sighs> Hey, listen up, Cruz. You better go over there and talk to her. Well, why me? I mean, isn't this more your thing? You're supposed to be the brash one. You saying I'm some thoughtless idiot? Yes. Well, there's stuff I'm not comfortable doing either. Poor Rosa, though. She was really broken up over Felia leaving her behind like that, huh? You... He's a fucking dumbass. He's in love with her, but doesn't want to even go talk to her in her time of need. Sure. I remember Rosa looking forward to being the new face at the end. She seemed pretty happy about it. She was obviously just acting brave for everyone. Oh, come on. You know she's always up to some little scheme. Like the way she's all nice to Adol because she got a crush. Well, yeah, but I don't... <clears throat> the two of you don't seem to be aware of just how much your voices can carry out here. You do know that you're supposed to talk like that out of your shot, yeah? Um, Rosa, are you? Come on now, we're not kids. You can stop, right? Please? Throw them over the cliff! Wait a sec. Let's talk this out. We can have a nice long chat. You're right, we're not kids anymore. So take your punishment like men! <laughs> Uh, dang it, Rosa! Uh, refreshing, huh? Good grief. Sorry for the trouble, but would you mind pulling me up, Adol? I swear. <laughs> hey! <laughs> I would've done the same thing. What the hell was that for? Sorry about that, Karja. But also, I want to say thanks for everything. I'm just really glad the two of us ended up becoming friends. 
so dang salty. Screw you. See what I <laughs> well, I got the handling and acceleration up a little. Delia. I'm sorry for how I acted earlier. I never stopped to think about what you were feeling. Rosalind. No, I'm the one who should be apologizing. I mean, just look at me. I'm still as selfish now as I was back before I left. And Mom and Dad. I really should have talked to them. Told them where I'd gone. I'm sure the two of them are still alive. Somewhere in the belly of Wolf. That's why. Once we find them, I'm... I'm going to... Gotcha! Wait to kill the moment, bro. Anyway, I'm really happy that both of you made up. It's great that we were able to rescue Rosa and all. We still have to figure out a way to get off this island. There's still a bunch of things that don't feel right to me about this place. How about we go explore some more? Oh. Adol, it's me, Layla. Layla? She's the one that gave Adol his mana powers, right? Uh. Wow, she really can speak to you through the seashell. Adol, I feel your presence more strongly than before. Where are you now? I see. That clarifies matters. You currently stand to the north of my location. Wait, so you're somewhere in the Marine Triangle too? Yes. That much is certain. It seems that Grieger are making their move much earlier than I anticipated. You know about the Grieger too? Yes. Of course. It may well be. Or what the... <clears throat> What's the deal? Why can't we hear her anymore? Adol! The serpent mark on your neck! Miss Carter! What is it? A single vessel is approaching us from offshore! It's an annoying free faction! Anchored here will be an easy target for their cannons. We're getting out before we end up in their firing range. But, but the island, exploration. It looks like the same ship that forced us into the tyrant. It's coming right at us. We're gonna have to fight back, Adol. Fire! Crap, I'm gonna come! They're firing at us like crazy! <laughs> Flood and thunder! We're still no match. It's true, we have to get out of there, but we'll be in trouble if we don't do something. Ezer, get down here and take the helm from Adol. Understood. It's do or die now. Come on, shield brother. We're boarding the enemy vessel. Stop telling me what to do. Ah! Let's go, shield sister. You lots ain't getting out of this alive. My oh my, you two really are something, I must say. Lugger, so it's you. Just like all the best sagas, I was hoping we'd see him again. How to exceed the reader's expectations. Learning that you've been in communication with Lady Leela was a particularly stunning twist. Hmm, who's to say? I'm more inclined to save the answers for when they'll really spice up this story. It wouldn't be any fun to fill you in about Lady Leela, or let you meet with her so soon. But meeting your untimely demise out here in the fog would be just as dull. Quit screwing around already! Oh, I assure you, I'm taking this quite seriously. Are you? As proof, let me present you with some options to give your tale a little... Kickstart. What? Cut you off guard, have I? As you can see, the fog that has settled over the Marine Triangle was my doing. Hmm. I wonder. The important thing is that you now have the opportunity to leave this fog. Or if you prefer, you could always stay here. Wandering about aimlessly for all eternity. You're sure in a hurry to shoo us away. Is that how important this Leela person is to you? Precisely. Even if it makes things difficult for me in the long run, acting so contrary to my role is such a rush. 
For transparency's sake, though, I'm not trying to intimidate you. My motives are entirely genuine. Honestly, I believe him. But I guess still want to say fuck you. I, I'm gonna do whatever the fuck I want. The path will close again before too much longer. However, so what's it going to be? <laughs> well, there's always the third option. We could kick your ass, kill you, and that looks the fog. I got a feeling I'm gonna have to say this because if I say this, it's probably gonna end up being this. Much as I'd rather not run. I know our limits. Even if we stay here, we still wouldn't have a way to deal with this fog. We're retreating for now. I suppose we have a deal then. Go on now. I promise we won't attack you. <laughs> we'll see about that. Let's go, Shield Brother. Take us out. Human feelings made manifest. How utterly troublesome. In truth, we aren't the terrifying ones. Nor are individuals like you, Adam. Humanity is the true terror. Well, he kind of has a point. So that's what happened. It's hard to believe the entire White Shade was the work of a single Grieger. Just, just what kind of monsters are they anyway? Everything that happened on Hayes Island was pretty mysterious too. I'd hate to think that Logger was behind not just the fog, but all that as well. Oh man, what's going to happen to us? If what Logger said is true, the fog's meant to keep us away from Leela, so your island shouldn't be in danger. I can't make any promises though. This is the same group that attacked Karnak. In that case, what if I stay behind here on Anchor Island for a bit? That way I could keep an eye on the White Shade and track the Grieger's movements. Oh, it would certainly put us more at ease to have you here. I really do appreciate you offering to do that for us, Miss Felia. Felia, you sure about this? Reinforcements from the Seaforce will be here to help soon, so there's really no reason to worry about me. Yeah, none at all. You can definitely handle yourself in a fight. Yours is a role only you can fill, Princess. That's what you need to focus on. Got it. I will. Oh, Adol. The brand on your neck disappeared again. Pretty sure it was visible when Logger showed. Maybe it only pops up if one of the tridents around. Huh? You're not going to stay with us on the Sandra Street, not. But I do want to thank you guys for looking after me while I was aboard. Not at all. We're the ones who should be thanking you. Why leave, though? After all it took to reunite us, Rosa. Uh, believe me, I really wish I could stay. But we each got our own parts to play right now. Mom, Dad, and everyone else from Karnak. They're still out there waiting for you to save them, right? Ilya, I'll be doing my best here. So you do the same for the princess and Adel, okay? I understand. This time, I'll try to do my best right alongside you. Nice to see you finally owning up to your feelings. I'm proud of you, kiddo. And when are you fi gonna finally man up and confess your feelings, bro? It's like they say, what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Are you two looking to go for another dip? I'm happy for you too, Philia. Leaving Rosa behind has been eating at you all this time, hasn't it? I... I suppose you could say that. Right then. The way things are, there's not much chance we'll be able to get through the fog, so we gotta plan our next course of action. You took a blow to the head? The answer's no. That reminds me. Did you ever hear anything more from Leela after our conversation earlier? So even our guide has gone silent, huh? Either way, trying to scrape up any clues in these parts would just be treading water. <sighs> What's up? Sounds like you're racking your brain about something. So, Logger didn't seem to want anyone to meet with Leela, right? I was just wondering who she is and how she fits into all of this. If memory serves, the Grieger are trying to find someone who makes for a suitable vessel, right? Maybe Leela has something to do with that? <sighs> well, now that you say it, it sort of seems like that's the only real possibility. If that's true, then it means this Leela person is crucial to the Baltic Sea Force, too. What we need is a way to get farther south into the Gulf. Then we can explore the Rogue Sea. As it happens, there's a route eastward through the Snellia Basin that should do just the trick. Right now, we're here, in the ultimate expanse. If we head due east, we'll eventually reach the Snellia Basin. Past that, though, we'd have to make our way through Specular Bay and the Fluman Strait. I've heard that the Fluman Strait in particular is even more difficult to navigate than the Maroon Triangle. Whoa, for real? Will we really be able to make it? The Baltic Sea Force doesn't typically pass through there. Never had much of a reason to. It's a pretty huge detour, so it'll take way longer, and of course, it'll be more dangerous. Um, wouldn't it be better to stay here and try to figure out a way to deal with the fog instead? If we beat that logger guy, it might clear up, sure. But we have no way of knowing where he is now. And even if we did, it'd be hard to find him in all that fog. Ah, uh, damn it! What are we supposed to do then? We're gonna meet your crossroads here. We can't afford to wait around, but we also can't afford to make the wrong choice. The one I want most, huh? Exactly. It's normal to run into problems that you don't have the answer to. When that happens, the important thing isn't making the right call, but making one at all. Right or wrong. Philia. But if you make the wrong choice, you might be stuck with it for good. Nah. Usually, being wrong just means you learn what not to do next time. If you just sit around and never make any decisions, you'll never learn a thing, you know? Oh. There's not a single person out there who's always got the right answer. All we can do is make a choice and then make the best of it. Wow, he can actually say something smart. That's the only way. Right, Adol? <laughs> sure wasn't expecting you to be the voice of reason here. Oh. Don't think anyone was. Realized just how great I am? No. Definitely not. I think you want to go for another dip. Let's dip. not get ahead of ourselves. 
Okay then, I'll make a choice. We'll take the Sunrise to the Rogue Sea in the south of Borelli Gulf by way of the Strait. I'm still curious about the Marine Triangle and the White Sheet. But for now, we can't do much more there. As we go, we'll continue to keep an eye on the Krieger and see what we can find out about Lila. Now, our path lies east. To the Sonelia Basin! Aye aye! Stop acting like you're the one in control. Oh, a new letter? What's this? Missing your big sister already, Rosa? No. Well, maybe a little. It's just... I know I was all gung-ho about joining the crew, but I'm not sure how to make myself useful to everyone. Sure, I work at the inn, but I'm not even half the cook my dad is. It's alright. Everyone has their anxieties. But even then, there are surely things that only you can do, Rosa. There, there. I'll always be here to lend you a shoulder when Felia's not around. Uh, hey, Mira! You don't have to get all touchy-feely with me! What in hell are those two on about? Hey, Cruz. Did you hear about when Adol rescued Rosa? Yeah, she started off as a puppet creaker before transforming into something disturbing. You didn't hear this from me, but I think her, uh, barbaric side was what made the difference. Oh, don't be ridiculous, Gren. There's no way... Uh, well, actually, now you've got me thinking. Where do we head next? Time for a little break. Where are you, Mara? Oh, thank God. Yes, upgrade. Yep, that ought to do it. Ah, uh, missing the shell rock. Anything else? You know where to find? <laughs> I knew you had an eye for quality. 108 and 120. Let's see. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's go ahead and buy them. Those are top shelf goods you just bought. Those are top shelf. I've still got. Now, where can I enhance? This way, then this way. Should be around here somewhere. Oh yeah, I keep forgetting about you. Let's see. Turned out nicely. <gasps> oh, turned out nicely. Turned out nicely. Oh, I gotta use shell rock. It turned out nicely. <gasps> All finished. And that needs more shell rock. It turned out nicely. It turned out nicely. <gasps> All finished. What should I do next? All prep I need to find where to get shell rocks. Need some. All cleaned and ready. All cleaned and ready. There, that'll do ya. There, that'll do ya. All cleaned and ready. There, that'll do ya. Need me to send it? Just leave the cooking to me. A box lunch then? And not as useful as the other one. But the ship movement speed is. Would you like anything? We look forward to your next visit. All right, on to the next area. Time to visit. Uh, 
Um. There, all done. Let's go with that. Any other medicine you can take care? What can I get you? Well, good to know I could buy as many of those as I need. Anything else? Oh, I'll probably end up forgetting again. Uh, I think that's about it. Wait. Did I ever go talk to Rosa? Wait. Is she even up here? Shops have any, what I need. You have that? Have a look at my other wares. Silly bones. Have a look at my other huh. All right, let's do this. The ship's this way. Ship's definitely moving a lot faster. Okay, that's useful. Hmm. Don't really care. And that takes care of that. Oh, that was a super easy side quest. go there and then there and I'm assuming I still can't go there actually can I no nah, I can't go to the ship I'll charge a direct course drop anchor we're going ashore <sighs> let's catch up right what's this actually Is 
it on now? Oh dear, you died by a sword cord. Have you no shame? I thought maybe. Well, if nothing else, I actually am getting experience and whatnot. save just in case these guys are too hard. Oh, of course I saved at the wrong spot. easier than expected. I want you. Okay, let's give it a shot. Mm, 
Mm, that's not really useful. What should I next? I'll prep you ready. All right, let's see. So that quest should be done there. Oh, I identified all the buried treasure. What's up? Wait, give me strength. Don't mind if I do. Let's do this. Both of these are good options. And both of which I would say. <laughs> Sounds like fun. That was a little easy. Oh, uh, Kevin area, I think. Nope. And I still can't go down yet. One more level. Let's keep sailing.
Uh, let's not do this. Airstream. It's not as treacherous as the tyrant. Guess we'll be getting through pretty smoothly this time. Is it just me? Rid of it. Can I actually go over here now? Wait, give me strength. Be a good spot to rest. Make tracks. Oh, since that's the right way. I got some more of those. I still don't want that. You must have come in here. Found something. Enjoying. It's a riot. Oh, 
Oh, fuck yeah. That explains what that was. So this is it then, huh? I'm sure it's a little bit asking, but what does the basin part of the meaning mean? Maybe it has something to do with how the nearby land makes a basin-shaped circle around it, and that's how it looked when they saw it on the map anyway. Actually, I think it refers to an area where there's a flat expanse of seafloor under the water. If the same place were on dry land, we'd probably call it a valley. It seems like such a lovely place, though. Is it really that difficult to cross? Nope. This is the easy part of the journey. What the heck was that? A whale, you dumbass. A whale? Could that have been the white whale? I've heard of him, but this is the first time seeing him in the flesh. They say he's lived in this part of the sea for over a hundred years. He really is amazing. Whoa! But what was that just now? He almost felt like an enemy ship pulled up alongside us. But that's impossible. We're the only ship out here for Cornelia. Either. What? Where's the Skeeter! I think he's the one that found us. What? Skeeter! Adel, avoid the best attacks as best you can while we press onward. Try to be careful, Adel. The water's up ahead and narrow, so you won't have much space to maneuver. Who can distract us? He's northeast. Press on as quickly as possible! All hands to stations! Adam, you have the help. Ah, it almost got us! Is everyone okay? A direct hit from the thing, we're sunk for sure! Well, this is useful. Ah, the ship! Full speed ahead! Try catching us now, you damn well. Full speed ahead! Whoa, lucky us! We've made it this far. Just gotta keep it up. Huh? Hey, get a load of that! The white fan is lying in wait up ahead, right in front of Bravo Sidon! If we want to get to the next region, we're going to have to pass right alongside the island. It's almost like he knows we're headed that way, and it's blocking off the passage on purpose. No, he's been battering us pretty hard. I don't think the hole will take much more. I don't get it, though. I've never heard the white whale attacking ships before. Miss Conja, I spotted a fishing boat on the way in. It was on the far island. I want to stop there and see what the boat's up to say. It'll be a bit out of our way. It seems it's our best bet. Adel, make for Fallen Island! Doesn't seem like we're being followed. Because he plans on sticking by that island. Damn it, white whale! Why do you gotta do us like that? Maybe that's the place it calls home? Anyway, let's head for Fallen Island. Eh. Alright, let's do it.
when I allow him not being chased, that'll let me save. I can't stand the highlights. Now, what was I looking for? Looks like I only need 5,000 more. Go ahead and save. And I think I'm gonna go ahead and call this a stream. We'll just uh, go ahead and pick up tomorrow and resume our adventure then. So without further ado, this is Akirian signing off. Peace.